You just recently signed uh, the kid Bobby Zane. I actually I'm in the process of signing process him. Process okay. But it's gonna be done. He just did something with Meek. I got him something with Meek, and one he got a drink with Gucci Mane. That's ridiculous. He definitely give me Gucci vibes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Young boy. So I, I don't want to be a dinosaur. You know what I mean? I, I'm a fan of like dudes like NBA Young Boy. Yeah. I'm a fan of like Roddy right Rich and all yeah. those young dudes. Yeah. That's the wave. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like music is evolving. A lot of these dudes are just straight up artists. You know what I mean? They they it's bigger than like hip hop. It's like yeah. it's they artists now. Like they rock stars. Like like For, yeah, it's no more. It's not Uzi rapping, Vert. Like, these guys rock stars. Are, you know what I mean? You, and he falls wanna, under that. He falls under that. that. Or you gonna you gonna Die. go away? You yeah. feel what I'm saying? So I was just like tone always keep me up on like the wave of. These new young dudes. New There's a lot of young dudes me. in the city that I know that they probably don't even know I know. Yeah, me too. And I'm uh, the <laughs> I just became a fan of him. I was like, yo, he's he's dope. He got he's it. fire. Yeah. You know what I mean? And he got a movement behind him. That that was really impressed press that was impressing to me. I'll tell you about that movement. That was impressive for real to me. And uh, you know, he's from the fairground. My mom from the fairground. You feel me? Oh, it makes sense. Yeah, makes so sense. I just uh I reached out to um my man. Rick Danes from Hip Hop Since 1987. And he managed him. I was just like, yo, mm. I'm thinking about signing the young boy, you know what I mean? But we're going to do it different this time. And uh, he was like, yeah, let's do it. So I sat down with him and I had my dad with him. He got to chop it up with my pop and just, we was just telling him about my background. Because it's a gap. He's a young, he's Yeah, really younger. Young. Yeah, young, young. So I got to learn about him. And his struggles and, and, and um, what he's trying to accomplish. Fell in love and with I was story. just like, man, I'm trying to help, man. I, I, you know, and I'm in, I'm, in a, uh, I'm in the middle of doing another label deal okay. somewhere um, that's way better. You know what I mean? Because I had one or eight, we had a deal with one or 88, but it was more so of a like uh, um, indie deal. And I had CRMC over there. Mm. But we couldn't move the way that we wanted to move. They promised a lot, promised us a lot of stuff that we couldn't do. Okay, you know what I mean. Mm. And they wanted to change their music as well. I never really told them that, but they wanted them to be what they wasn't. Like what? What do you mean? CRMC is very talented. They these young dudes like they they can rap. They can do a rap lot of asshole. stuff, but they wanted them to be like quote unquote these clout chasing rappers. You feel okay, what I'm saying? The bullshit. And that's what they they more so like me. Their persona, you know what yeah. I mean? They ain't trying to do, they trying to make the music and be out the way. Fuck yeah. But with this next situation that I'm doing, it'll enable like a label, it's a label deal. So it's mm -hmm. like, we probably, you know, we probably don't get the same cuts, but it's a label deal. And I can take these young artists and this talent from Chester and, and really blow them up. Cause I feel like that's the last thing on my list I've been able to accomplish a lot of things, but I haven't been able to break any artists from Chester. Mm, yeah, and, that's why I wanted to know. And, like right and now, that's it's probably my biggest goal is to find somebody that I fool with, and uh, and, and 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 blow them up. Because me as a um, me as a producer, I can't really do. I, I, and then I'm a behind the scenes producer, mm -hmm. so I can't really do uh, like. Certain things these artists like Rick Ross can do with a Meek Mill. Yeah. You know what I mean? Okay. All I could do is kind of share my resources, but this will give him the chance to have some money behind him yeah. and do what he got to do.